Hey, what's going on today, y'all? I'm Jake with Bullet Safe Bulletproof Vest. This is my good friend Bob, and you're watching How Bulletproof. Uh, you know, a lot of people out there, if they were to find themselves in an active shooter situation, they might find cover around their cubicle with different office equipment, things like that. So today we wanted to figure out just how bulletproof office equipment can be. We're gonna show you how devastating different rounds are to this office equipment versus our 3A bulletproof vest. Got the 45 auto and the 230 grain full metal jacket. Let's see what she does. Right off the bat, you can see we've got some tearing now. That's not actually the bullets puncturing the armor panel. What that is is back face defamation, just ripping that up. Just to be safe, same thing here. That's not actual bullet penetration, that's just back face defamation. All right, so as you can see here, we've got just various office equipment. Uh, I got some monitors, computers, those are hot. Uh, printer back there, various things like that. First thing we're gonna shoot it with is a nine mil just to see uh, how bulletproof is office equipment. Good shot right here on the monitor. We are through one PC, two PCs. Huh. Apparently for a nine mil, that's still hot. Apparently for a nine mil, all you need is one monitor and uh, two computers. We got a good shot here, nothing coming out the back. So how bulletproof is office equipment? According to a nine mil, this is all you need. You learn something new every day. I had honestly thought nine mil was gonna pass through all these, prove me wrong, peeved me off a little bit. So uh, we're gonna take it to these computers, shoot her with a 5.56 five, and see how well she does against those. Chances are with this old bad boy, uh, we're gonna go a little bit further, but let's see. Oh, just into the second PC. And absolutely no damage to the third. So, hey, again, y'all, I'm I'm pretty freaking blown away by this. Not going to lie. The fact that a 9 mil it only took two and a 5.56 five, only took two. Pretty surprising results there. So, um, well, we had planned only to shoot this with a 5.56, five, expecting it to go all the way through. But might as well throw the whole boat at her. I wanted to see little bits and parts of computer pieces flying everywhere. Hadn't got there yet. So, Old Faithful here, 30-06. All right, that makes me a little bit happy. We are through two. Oh, these are kind of stuck together, actually. Ran up to get something pretty interesting here. These two are actually pretty much stuck. There we go. Now we're into the third. Finally, I get my good shot on these things. Entered the fourth piece of office equipment right here. No exit. So we got some pretty good pass through on the uh, second 30-06 shot. Honestly, I'm still not happy that those computers are still standing over there. So I'm gonna take my AR-15 here and uh, pump this office equipment full of some frequencies by God. I feel much better now. I'm not sure about you. Um, let's see what we did. Now we're finally into the third. Unfortunately, no pass through on the brakes. We wanted to put to the test some office equipment and uh, surprisingly, much more bulletproof than I thought it would be. Uh, you know, 5.56 five, with one shot, made it through two, same as the nine mil. 30-06 definitely had the most penetration, but 
At the end of the day, yes, we didn't get through all the office equipment, but you're much better off trusting a bullet safe 3A armor vest. Remember, the vest and the plate are now NIJ certified, made in the USA. Our vest is less than $300. Our level four standalone plates are less than 200. Thanks for watching today. I'm Jake. I'm with Bullet Safe Bulletproof Vest. Y'all stay safe out there.